From the International Telecommunications Union headquarter in Geneva, we are celebrating the World Telecommunication and Information Society Day. This year, we're uh, pleased to have with us Ms. Hilda Mutseekwa, the Director of Economics, Tariffs, Competition and Consumer Protection at the Zimbabwe Telecommunication Regulatory Authority. Welcome, Hilda. Thank you, Belair. We're pleased to have you with us um, and would like to know from you your experience with the uh, standardization uh, program and the bridging the standardization gap. Uh, how did that affect you personally? Uh, how did it affect the region and perhaps the, the whole study group? Bilero, uh, I must say that we are very excited about this uh, bridging uh, the standardization gap uh, program. We've uh, benefited immensely from this program. And um, for me, I've been attending uh, study, group, study group three uh, meetings uh, for many years. And prior to that, I didn't understand. I didn't have a clue of what was happening. I only listened to the arguments, read the contributions, but I didn't know how to make a contribution myself. I didn't understand uh, how to go about it. But now, I think I'm almost uh, a guru in that. Very good. And uh, why is this important to, uh, to, your, to your country, to your region, in terms of being an, an active participant? First, I think uh, it um, helps uh, in ITU achieving its goal of inclusivity because it uh, helps us, uh, especially with the um, developing countries, to participate more actively in ITU work and uh, its deliverables. And I think that is very important. Um, we are also, um, it also helps us um, improve how we do our work uh, back home. So the information sharing and the yes. knowledge about what others are doing uh, helps you at home in, in your work? Yes, it's very helpful. And we've benefited. And most of what we, we take from the ITU, we always make sure we implement back home. Thank you very much. And I wish you a happy uh, World Telecommunication and Information Society Day. Thank you very much. We hope uh, this program will continue.